Hello everybody, my name is Provis. Welcome back to more CK3, Princes of Darkness, playing as Ma'atkare of Maghreb. Uh, a ransom for somebody pays 50 gold to me. Yep, I'll take that, thank you. There we go, a little bit of extra cash and never hurt me at all. We are trying to start exploiting the fact that I am able to fabricate my own secrets against people in order to try and exploit them. That's not going to work most of the time on like counts and duchesses and stuff who only will ever pay you like 50 gold for a hook in the first place. Might work against some foreign kings and queens. So, let's see. Failed to get anything on the matriarch, but your Ferris, Cody, might have something. Can I... Okay, hang on. I gotta wait for the little thing. Do you have money? You do. So, I'm curious if this will work. Let's fabricate a hook on you. So, we now have a hook. And then... I can invite you to court. I can demand payment of 50. All right, so that did not work out. I, f I don't know, actually. Can you only ever get 50 at all? Is that, like, the most you ever can get? If that's the case, then I'm wrong. This doesn't actually work quite the way that I wanted it to. Focused on the hunt, sure. Yeah, that I don't think that it's going to work quite the way that I thought it would. All right, well, let's just start finding secrets of random people in my courts, then. See what we can use. So, I guess it's a way for me to spend money just to gain a hook in order to try and control someone. For example, I could have demanded that person came to my court. Would have been an option for me. Uh, your grandson? No. And every time we decide we're not going to do this, which ticks extremely fast, we just start gaining some free opinion with a bunch of people. Case in point over here, your court chaplain. Yeah, it's just too expensive to do that. I'm looking for things that people are doing that is illegal. You gotta help me here. We could've, could've, actually, now that I think about it, gotten a hook on Jamila over here. We had that option earlier. Murdered you, you would've inherited, then I could've used, uh, used the hook to take over this territory. That would've been an option. Didn't really think about doing that. Probably could've. Laying back. This is gonna be expiring in just a few months, thank God. Uh, we discovered a secret. Oh, you've taken a Chancellor of my friend. As a lover, this is useful to know. Can I exploit this in some way? Yeah, I can blackmail somebody. Gain a hook on you, I guess. Who are you? I have no idea. Well, I'm gonna blackmail you. We've definitely discovered a lot of secrets. They're just not secrets I care about. You don't even have any money. Also discovered another secret. Okay, 12th generation. Blah, blah, blah. We don't care about that. Alrighty, well, um, hmm. Hello, Algarve up over here. You actually have managed to carve yourself a fairly large empire from the Midnight of the Crescent. Be kind of fun to kill you and start pushing up into Iberia, but I'm not really worried about that yet. Much more important that we continue working over here on Tahirt. Um, Your daughter, Marina. Question, is your daughter your heir? No. Okay. And a hook has expired on somebody, my granddaughter. Oh. Well, that's unfortunate, but not a huge deal. Okay, um, hmm. Well, I think we want to attack Tunis. We talked about this earlier, and I think we still do that. Another opportunity to get a hook on your daughter. Hmm. So if I declare war on you, they are inferior. I could call in an ally. I could fight for the Kingdom of Africa. Which would be a little on the expensive side, but it would let me take over two duchies simultaneously instead of only one. Which seems pretty good. I can only do this once every 50 years. Are there many other places that hold almost an entire kingdom? Yes. This over here, the Sahara. Kawar. If I used the kingdom uh, cast a spell against them, we could take over all of this. So I'm not sure we necessarily want to waste our special ability there. Not yet. I think it would be better to go for a duchy. Or even better, maybe temporarily weaken you by just going for a simple county right here. Just one. Clear out some of the border gore. Beat you up a little bit. It'd be far more effective if we actually just siege down a duchy, though. I mean, take away a duchy for them, then she really is significantly weaker. All right, I think this is what we're going to try for. Um, I don't have a lot of cash to work with. 
And I do feel like we would benefit strongly. No, my ally sucks. Never mind. All right. Let's go ahead and declare the war. I need to raise up my entire army. This is probably going to cost me a lot of money until we can at least smash their armies. But here's hoping that this is actually going to work out well for me. And that my husband's going to be amazing. Uh, what else are you guys doing? 16 days left on converting a province. That's great. You are just a bunch of levies, and you're going to head over here and siege this barony. You are going to stay over here ready to reinforce. You are going to go here. Why is this army so good? This army has exceptionally high troop quality. Because it has a lot less levy. The fact that I have so many peasant rabbles serving me is one of the reasons I'm struggling on some of this. Uh, let's see. Your daughter-in-law? Nope. Man, finding secrets is proving to be tough. Pause! Okay. Um, bring you up over here, ready to defend if we need to. I don't know where they're going. Probably off in this direction. I'm getting opinion with a lot of people. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and march over here and just siege down Trabasa. You guys stay put for now. Just reinforce this. Algiers is under siege. My truce with someone has ended early. Well done. No immediate use for that, but well done nonetheless. All right. Forget this. We're not getting we're not getting any freaking secrets and he's going so fast that it's interrupting me nonstop. Uh where else should we do some conversions? How about over here? Maybe we can convert her along the way. I don't know. I'm going to investigate my friend here and see if we can exploit her for some money. Hopefully without having to make up a hook. Because that just costs too much. Alright, burying the hatchet. Stop being rivals with somebody who's unlanded and I don't care about you. <sighs> no. In fact, uh, if you were closer, what I could do is murder you and you get a stress reduction for uh, a uh, rival dying. That actually would have been tempting, but oh well. Yeah, we're going to be bleeding a lot of cash very quickly here. We can't afford to sit on this for too long. We need to go siege some stuff. Go up over here, I guess. Start working toward their capital. If they want to siege down one province for every three that I can get, that's fine. Eventually we'll win. Or, better yet, I'll be able to start uh, disbanding some of my troops. Move them elsewhere. Or, or even better, siege down three things simultaneously. Oh, hello. Now I'm concerned. Are you going to come attack me? Oh, yes, it's exactly what you're here to do. Time to run. Run away. He's coming for me. Yep. Oh, God, he got close. See, he even drew his saber. He's like, oh, I'm going to get him. Oh, gosh, he's going to get me. Well, if my reinforcements can arrive in time, we would win. But I'm not convinced that they will. So I'm going to have to let them get hit. Oh, God. I'm going to tell them to retreat. Nope, they just died straight out. Ouch. Ouch. All right, send the reinforcements down here and get ready. Okay, that's right. He's running away. You stay out of here. Now we go work on your capital while you go somewhere else. You're gonna siege down Belisma? That's fine, go for it. Okay, we siege that. Now we have to go work on another barony over here. Holy vey. Well, this solves some of my money issues in the sense that it's gonna take a little while longer now. Ha ha ha. We are missing a marshal. Was he captured? Might have been, actually. Um, you'll have to be my backup then. I don't think you're very good, but you're gonna have to be my backup. While I start regenerating my levy back up to 6,000 again. Okay, so we're still working on a couple of sieges simultaneously. The only thing I lost out of that were my, um, my levy armies, which aren't even very good. Okay, he's coming back toward me. Hang on, back up. Back it up. I think he's going to come try to fight me, and I want to be ready. Maybe he wants to go save his capital. Another experienced fighter. Let me guess, you also take like 300-something... No, you actually are... 20. Oh. You're not that good, though, so forget you. 
Why can't I siege this? Is this part of this county or something? Something weird's happening here. Yeah, it was, actually. Bizarre. All right. So, he's running off again. Fine. Let's go siege this while you go siege this. And since we've wasted their time and now they're working on two separate places, we can go siege these. Depending on where he goes, we might want to turn around. No, he's trying to unseed stuff to save the Wargle. That's fine. I'm going to take the stuff that's far away from you. Then you'll run off to the west and I'll just re-siege this and we'll be fine. I'll just follow up behind you. The stuff far away, siege down, makes this easy. All right, so we get this. Got it. Thank you. Imprisonment. Yes. I am looking for prisoners. This is good. I lost the fight? You've got to be kidding me. Well, we can ransom somebody for 10 gold. Every little bit helps. I'll take it. Okay, he's going for over here now. Um, we need to win this siege quick and get all the troops together. I need the higher quality troops and my counter and my knights to have a chance of winning this. Because this would be kind of hard to just beat on my own with 3,000 troops. I only have three knights here. That's not nearly enough. It's going to unsiege things so fast. It's very annoying how quickly he can do things like that. Tell you what, you get back down over here. You go join up over here. We'll see if we can intercept him. We'll kill whoever this knight was, so they're dead. Okay, group up. My husband's in charge. If we attacked you, it says we would win, so we're going to make a beeline for you right now. He's going to unsiege this, but we get to have a big fight. And yes, indeed, it looks like the numbers are pretty well in my advantage, even though I have less knights. Gosh, a lot of the levies get slaughtered when that happens, though, don't they? So we're going to go ahead and split you in half. And take half of you and go and siege down this or something. Let's just start working on these two forts again. The White Boar. Send a missive or something. I don't know. I'm sure it'll be fine. Comfort of a friend. Lose some stress. This lady who hates me just comforted me? What a true friend. Oh my god. All right. I don't know who you are, but fine. Let's just stop being rivals because you're annoying. Cool. We have 97% war score. If I can just win this siege before they get this, I think we win. Which means this actually was a fairly easy war all in all. I lost a bit, but fairly easy. Okay, apparently not. Um, sensual proposal. This leper could become my lover. Well, I can't become sick, but um, yeah, that's ridiculous. Never, and people shall know that you are a horrible person. Your perverted nature doth offendeth me. How fast will this siege? Four months versus three months. Let's send some more troops to make sure that we have as much advantage here as possible. Group all of you up. I love that my husband has military engineer. That's so good. And that's 100% done. Because now we own the war goal. Boom. Bye. Oh, and I'm at war already. Well, hello. With who? You? Hi. Um, I wasn't expecting this. I didn't desire it. I didn't ask for it. But since you've decided to be annoying, we need to go and kill you now. I'm just going to walk over here and completely, utterly, totally rout you. Get out of here, sucker. Die! Stack white. Go for his capital. Or something. I don't know. Actually, wait. Is this a... Is that a bearing title, uh, title under construction? It might be. Regardless, let's go ahead and send both over there. We can finish this up pretty quick. So, how big is this duchy really? It should have one more province. If I create a new duke over there... We'll figure that out. Let's find a good character. Um, sum of skills. My husband is still by a long shot one of my best characters. I think we will take, let's say, you. Because you have some extra stewardship. And I'm going to grant you both of these. There we go. You can become a double count. Yep, that is a siege that we have to win. Okay. Contribution to the war chests. A bunch of people pay money to me. Oh. Act of Tyranny, lose 10 opinion. Mm. Or gain opinion. No, uh, I welcome the generosity. I'm not going to lose all that opinion. I don't think I need it. This war should be relatively fast for me to end. But losing 10 opinion with everyone also wasn't that big of a deal. I guess I could have just stolen like an extra 140 gold or so out of that. It wouldn't have been too bad. I like that these troops are much higher quality all of a sudden. That's great. Man, I really need to stop relying so much on freaking levies. But what else am I going to do? I need my men-at-arms, dang it. All right, that's 100%. Well, I could wait on that, but you know, let's just go ahead and finish the siege so I can loot some extra cash and maybe get a prisoner or two. Got it. See, we got 25 more gold simply for doing that. Perfect. All right, so what did we do here? You're going to pay me war reparations of 114 gold. 
See, that's great. I like inheriting your easy little wars. This is silly. Great stuff. Good. All right. So now we actually have a little cash again. Not a lot, but I'm making eight ducats a month again. It's not enough. It's never enough. How am I supposed to get more money? I need more money. How's my dread doing, by the way? It's down to only 25 and dropping fast. Ugh. How are we doing on factions? Yeah, there's a Liberty faction going on here with a few people who are causing issues, including... I'm sorry, are we, are we serious again with this? Are we serious with this nonsense that my Duke is going to be causing so many problems? I hate you. Leaving an impression. A cultist is coming to play me tribute. However, my husband suggests a military display. Cowed vassal for 10 years. I lose Marshall. He becomes susceptible to dread. No, I'll just take the prestige. Okay, well, the good news is they're too weak to send me an ultimatum right now. And the discontent is gradually dropping. I thought I made you my friend. Did I not? I did not. I thought we were trying. Oh, right. For some reason, that stopped. I don't remember why that stopped, but it did. Um, also, a bunch of my friend, uh, other people who can't join factions are able to again. Yeah, okay. Well, let's see. Um, can I find... You're my friend. I need to find all of my du dukes and make sure that we make them into loyal subjects, like you. Yeah, my court chaplain and stuff. But you already are pretty loyal. What about the Duchy of Seuss? You're my chancellor. People who hold a position on my council are generally going to be more likely to support me still. But all right, let's go ahead and befriend you. You're a powerful person who wants to be on the council. We make you a friend, you can't join the council. Or rather, you can't join a faction, which means you're not actually a threat. Uh, we will go for, wow, my feats, prestigious image, scheme power goes up, thank you. I'll take some prestige, why not, that's great. Okay. Uh, anything else we should be building in Tlemcen? Anything else we can do? Development is going up. It's getting there. We can reduce popular opinion by a lot. Still doesn't seem very good to do that. My cousin was captured, don't really care. Could hold another Elysium. Apparently, I can uh, find some knights. Do I not have enough knights? I got plenty of knights. What are we talking about? I got more than enough knights. And the worst one I've got right now, I think, is at 17. So that's pretty solid, honestly. I'm not really worried about that. I think that's fine. Why am I not making more money? The vassal taxes aren't good enough. I can demand a payment from somebody. Yeah, all right. We'll go ahead and do that since I, I did already get the hook on you. We might as well just get the money back. Or at least most of the money back. I want to fight the Sea of Shadows. But this guy's pretty strong right now. Uh, so I'm not sure how well that'll go for me. That said, if I'm careful, he will... I mean, he controls like almost all of Naples at this point. He'll have to drop some troops over here. If I'm able to intercept and maybe get um, a landing penalty on him, we could crush him. But there are alternatives. Uh, we can continue pushing into Africa by fighting over, let's say, Jared. Gosh, aren't you a character and a half right there? Hello. What if I decided to take over this Duchy of Jared? And then we'll eventually circle back around and we'll take this and we'll take Mzab. Yeah, that's a thing. You have an ally who is strong-ish. Where are you located? I have no idea. Bamberg? Okay, so you're far away. Uh, yeah. We could do that. Let's do it. Raise the armies. This should be very fast. We should not need much. And in fact, this levy army, I'm going to go ahead and disband and stop paying for them. We don't need them. And they're only going to drop down my uh, troop quality by a lot, so forget that. Alright, so you... All of you are going to try to intercept and kill this guy. Losing a bit of cash, again, that's fine. I need to save up some money so I can form the kingdom title of Tehert. Get a proper du jour claim. Alright, so you go here. And you 
find another barony. Can we get over here? Not without taking some attrition. Get over here. Captured somebody. Perfect. 25 gold, I'll take it. Okay, so we should be able to siege these pretty darn quick. Thank you, onagers. An enjoyable evening! I have become friends with this duke. Excellent. So, can we stop with this? Because I already got you back up to 100 opinion. I need to now... Wait, who was I... Who was I enticing? I'm confused now. Who actually was I enticing? You just took over all of this? Oh, frick. You, sir, are too strong. You took over way more territory than I'm okay with. Wait, no, that's Merrick. No, I'm an idiot. We're fine. We're fine. I was thinking this and Seuss together. No, 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 no. He's fine. He's fine. The white boar. Okay, 66% chance um, this is correct. Its existence is not a sign of Set himself. It's none of your business or your right. I will no longer hunt. Oh, good lord. 66% chance. You've got to be kidding me. I do actually have, like, abysmal luck. In a lot of things, I have abysmal luck. It's true. Oh, well. Um, hi. So, Mr. County Holder, um, I want to revoke your title, but this would be an act of tyranny. So, I need to do something. Expose a secret that you're eighth generation? No, that does nothing. I'm going to investigate you and see if we can find that you're doing something illegal. We've already tried finding secrets. It didn't work out very well. I'm going to start fabricating a claim over here and see if we can find any way of justifying taking this territory for myself. Because we now are up to four possible holdings. I could get a strong hook and get him to back off. The question is, will I become a tyrant at the same time? I don't want people seeing me as a tyrant. It's ridiculous. I'm no tyrant. Art thou with kidding? Um, we can go over here to this barony safely. You have to go to this barony. He's gonna work on this siege, but it's not gonna matter, because if I can siege down anything else, we're fine. And this should go pretty quick. Five months there. Eleven months here. Pretty fast. The enemy of Rome. When studying the tactics of ancient generals, I was astonished to learn about the exploits of Hannibal. Oh, alright. I can finally gain a trait. It's only been forever. Aggressive attacker is pretty good. Logisticians, okay, sometimes. Flexible leader gets me defensive advantage reduction on them. Uh, I'll go for aggressive attacker. I like being able to inflict casualties and crushing them. So if I win a battle, I keep them down. See, I follow the Ender strategy, right, from Ender's game. Uh, if someone is attacking you and you have to fight, fight them and beat them down so hard that they never get back up to be a threat to you ever again. That's the idea. Still not a lot of... Oh, factions are disbanding. Okay. Lost the siege. Don't care. Once we finish both of these, that'll be it. Um, not many prisoners here. Okay, we managed to siege that. That's great. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and disband you because we don't need you anymore. Just go ahead and save a little bit of cash while we finish up this next siege. Four months remaining. I don't know where you're going. You're running all over the place. That'll be fine. Could also try creating, let's say, some more cities and stuff down over here and try to really increase the value of Tlemcen. That'd be another way of me getting some serious money. Yes, yes, we've learned some more stupid things that I don't care about. Blech. Blech, I say. Like a vampire. Blech. I do not say blah, blah, blah. 17 gold. Oh, we got a prisoner. But alas, no one that I can ransom. Fine. Done with this. Bye, foo. Ba, 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 ba. All right. So, over my holdings, because we've got three different titles over here, let's find some characters who don't like me. And get rid of them. Most of these people who hate me are not actually in my, like, court. So we'll get rid of you. And then we will want to find a character who actually is good. Not my husband, tempting as that is. I wouldn't mind having someone else who's actually good at diplomacy. I'll go ahead and give you these. Boom. I suppose one thing I could do is find vassals who have enough cash on hand that they can form the duchy title themselves. Like this person. This person did this. Actually, I can make you happy if I grant you this vassal. He belongs under you anyway, and I don't like him. There, see? Now he's your problem. See? See? That's what we're supposed to do. Yeah! Go form your duchy titles. 
They should do that pretty much as soon as they can. Some of these guys aren't making a lot of money very quickly, but you know, whatever. All right, good, good, good. So I imagine then that this person will be able to get some money. You've already got 100 gold you're making two per month. Give it some time, you'll become Duke on your own. Hey, Mazab, so you attacked me unprovoked and you weren't allowed to do it. I'm gonna go ahead and take this away. Uh, but I don't wanna raise all armies. I'm gonna raise all men at arms and let them go do their thing. And all 10 knights show up over here. That's pretty good. Now it says we have a numbers disadvantage, but I'm not sure I believe it. Shouldn't I have 14 knights set up over here? I don't know. They're elite quality. They're all very stronka. Lots of counters. My husband's amazing. Man, I married well this time. I imagine we should be able to win this fight without any real consternation on my part. You got nine knights, but it says that I have a very big advantage against you here. Yeah, we're fine. And this costs me very little, because I'm not using all the rabble. Rabble, rabble. Can you serve the Duchy of Jared? Duly noted. Don't care right now. We killed them. We captured somebody. I'm going to ransom you for 25 gold. Anyone else? Nope. Okay. I'm actually very close to being able to form the next kingdom title, which would actually be a very good place to end the series if you guys want to. Oh no, really? My really amazing spy master just died. What? No! Serve well as a consort. Hi. Um. Hmm. Yes. Never hurts to ask, right? All right, so I need a new spy master. I'm really disappointed by that. We had a really good spy master, and all of a sudden we don't. Um, I'd rather make you my marshal, so he will. Solves a problem with one of my dukes. And as far as spy masters are concerned, I don't have great characters. I don't really like the idea of having somebody who doesn't like me. But you are the most talented, so I think we will have to. And I need to sway you pretty quick. Let's go for it. You tried to rise some troops back up. Not gonna work. Okay, we captured somebody, and I think we killed him. He immediately died. Okay, that's fine. Hostages. 87% chance. 100% chance. 95 for 96. We captured a bunch of people. Well, that can only be amazing. Captured the Duke himself. Okay, and we can ransom, I think, all of them. Ransom for 10. 25. Oh, that's all I can do at the moment. Hang on. 25. Yes, yes, I know. We're technically getting rid of my war score, but, like, who cares? I own his only title. All right, you're done. Bye. Thank you. That was easy. Uh, hi. So, you... I could give you this... You're not my friend, but we need to make you a friend. I'm going to befriend you, and I am, in fact, just going to go ahead and give you this title. There. You can control pretty much all of this. How's that sound? Good? Good. Found the Holy Order is still an option. If I want to. Which I'm not convinced that I do. I think it might be more profitable for me... ...to try to form the kingdom. Which will cost me 500 gold, which is, of course, a lot, but I am now a double queen. There we go. There's another war going on over here in Marrakesh. Gosh dang it, can you guys just get your affairs in freaking order? Do you need me to step in here? Because I can do that. Alright, so we are a double queen. I can have up to 9,000 levy all of a sudden. Good lord. If only that mattered. If only it did. But it doesn't. Uh, oh boy. I guess I'll lose a little prestige and talk him up a little bit. I need to make my spy master happy. Um, yeah, if only it mattered, but the knights are so good, and the counters are so good for men-at-arms that the levy gets smashed. Like, having that many troops is just an economic burden more than anything. Alright, I've become friends with you, I guess. Uh, there we go. Yes, let's become friends with you. Sure. I guess. I have a limit to how many friends I can get. Oh, there we go. So I have no idea how close I am to that limit, but we can take a look real quick. 
relationships, friends. I have five friends. Two of which really don't much care for me. Why are you upset? What did I do? You want to see it on the council really badly. Well, if you had more talent, I'd consider it, but you don't. S -s -s savage Um, we had talked about possibly, like, trying to, you know, get a claim over here or something, and I think we still want to do that. So, we're about to have five months left on getting a claim on you. Breach of the Masquerade. Oh, somebody violated the Silence of Blood, revealing Nuno, Nuno as a vampire. Uh, okay. Chance that I will become hungry and make someone... We could kill some people. Who are you people? You're unlanded. You, I don't like. Right. Hang on. Can we get... Can we just... Can I kill Nuno? No. Darn it. All right, I have to deal with this freaking mortal. Who knows too much. This is a crime to me. Ooh. Um, ignore him, gain... He gains stress. 10% chance exposure goes up. Hmm. Because he's deceitful... He's not deceitful. Oh, he becomes deceitful. Ah, lose the opinion loss. Kill him? Kill him. As for you, Nuno, you violated the silence of blood. Arrest him. I have a fair reason. I'm not even a tyrant. Arrest this fool. We failed to bring him in. Weaklings. Okay, hang on. Real quick. What other factions are you in? If we do this, we'll have to fight a bunch of people. Um... This would be a chance for me to reshuffle some stuff. He's a known criminal. Yeah, this is an act of tyranny. I have to get him to actually, like, do something stupid. Fabricate hook? Because this becomes the alternative. If I don't want to try to fabricate a claim on this, I can instead take this away from him. And he's been a thorn in my side for a while. I actually kind of like that idea, I think, a little bit better. Before we waste the money on this. Let's go ahead and fabricate a hook against you we can use. You're a criminal. We can get a hook. You'll step down. You're not. It's not going to be a tyranny, I think. So cancel the fabrication. Let's go ahead and start converting this instead. Okay? I think that'll be fine. Maybe, or maybe it's a terrible idea. Regardless, now we're making a pretty good amount of cash here. Uh, almost it's up to 12 gold per month. It's not a ton, but it's something. Tunis should be relatively easy for me to smash going forward. The Sea of Shadows is certainly a threat. This little duchy right over here technically is something I'm going to need to seize and feed off the person that I want to make a duke over here. There's also Gabe's. Hi, Gabe. And we could fight over your duchy. Take over two titles, including Sfax and such. So that'd be easy enough. Has a truce with me, though. Never mind. Jafara. Yeah, we got a lot of territory now along the African kingdom that we can start pushing into. And very soon, if we want to push south, we can go fight Kawar and try to do a holy war over this entire kingdom. Do things like that, and all of a sudden, the uh, opportunity to form the empire of Makreb is starting to look really, really likely, isn't it? How close are we? We are over halfway. 45 out of 72. It would likely be another few videos before I'll be able to pull that one off. Let me know what you guys think, and I will decide if I want to continue the series or if we should move on to other stuff. Thank you all very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If so, then I would ask you to hit that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time.